is a segment from the 7th Just RPG.com podcast. If you enjoyed this podcast, please make sure to check the video description below where you'll see a link to the full version. Enjoy. So, my next question is, what are the most overrated RPGs? Of all time, like any system? Yeah. Okay. Um, my number one pick. And again, hey, I, I think I said this before. Uh, Final Fantasy VII. Oh no, that's mine too. <laughs> I mean, it was great for the time in, in terms of gaming history, where it fits in. It, it fits in very well. You got full motion video for one, you know, one of the first times in, you know, optical media, home console. Um, you have like cool battles. You have fleshed out story mm -hmm. stuff. But I, I am not a huge fan of it. It's very blocky looking. I mean, some stuff at this, around the same time looked much better. You have oh like yeah, Legend of Dragoon. Yep. Also PS One looks much better in my opinion crash bandicoot looked way better than that game <laughs> yeah but crash was had a smaller screen throughout the game like it was I very zoomed so. in it didn't have to like render stuff in the distance but yeah but yeah i'm gonna go with final fantasy 7 for sure awesome i also think so um i don't think it deserves a remake uh mm. i actually never even played the whole thing because all right so, <clears throat> I got into Final Fantasy really late. Um, I think 9 was actually my very first one. Okay. It's one of my favorites. And, like, all, after all these years I'd heard, Oh, well, you should play Final Fantasy 7, it was the best of all time. It's actually one of the greatest games ever created. And that's when I was like, I'm gonna hate this game instantly. <laughs> I, I mean, think was I it just... because it was popular, or...? I kind of hated it out of spite, so yeah. And then I finally played it, and I'm like, it's it's really not that great, especially since I played nine and then ten right after. You know, I thought nine right was that. way better. I'd oh say, yeah, like okay, maybe it beats out eight, but nine definitely is much better. Eight was garbage. Opinion. I hated Final Fantasy eight. <laughs> I mean, most people agree with you, but I know like Maxwell, for example, he he likes yeah. that game a lot. <laughs> Um, it is 8, I think I played 8 before 7, and I don't hate it as much as everyone, but it was not amazing. I it was, it was complex, and for, for no yeah, reason. Unnes it was unnecessarily pretty... complex. Yeah, there was like, there wasn't enough grinding, like, I died a lot in Final <laughs> Fantasy 8. Oh yeah, yeah but back to 7. Too easy, yeah, okay. It didn't deserve a movie? Why? That movie didn't even make sense. What? What happened? All right, that movie made no sense, but <laughs> but I understand why they did and why they did a remake and why they've done like at least two or three spinoffs of it. Yeah. It's because it's popular. Maybe it's the character. Maybe it's Cloud. People really like Cloud. He's got he's a cool so sword. edgy. Yeah, he Ooh. is very. He's like the Sonic. Of... Bring an edge lord over here. I mean, th that was Sonic's original gimmick. Sonic was like the edgy alternative to Mario. Was so I, he? Yeah, that's that's why he. That's how they marketed him. Oh my god. Yeah, so I guess Cloud's kind. Of, I, Cloud definitely has that same appeal, that same kind of fan base. I think. Weeaboo girls. Sorry, no offense. Yeah, I mean, yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you're right. They would love that. You know, Cloud and Sephiroth. Doing stuff. Things. Gross. Behind closed uh, doors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, that's definitely, I think, my number one. Um, I I don't know if you're going to agree with this either, but I'm, I'm going to have to go with Kingdom Hearts as well. Okay, yes. I think, I don't know why adding Disney characters to a game made it more appealing. Um, it kind of has that edgy feel to it, too. Sora. It's a little dark, yeah. Edgy. It's not as dark because it's Disney, but mm. yeah, I I, I kind of got that same feel from the game as a whole. But I thought if the game just took out those Disney elements, put in some original ones, I probably would have liked it more. Really? Yeah. I mean, don't I get me like... wrong. I do like Disney movies, like the yeah. older ones and stuff. That I do enjoy watching them. But I thought if that, 
I just thought it didn't fit that weird storyline and that edginess was kind of thrown in with Disney and it made it kind of weird. But that's just yeah, my I opinion. See, I see where you're coming from. Um, once again, the fan base ruined that game for me. <laughs> I can see that. What? I can see that. Yeah, it's... Every time I hear Kingdom Hearts, I cringe a little, and I'm like, I don't want to talk about it. And people get mad at me when I say that I don't like it that much, and I didn't play the second one. And I think two by 373 days or whatever, what what kind of title for a game is that? What is that? See, I really liked Chain of Memories, the card game one. Yeah. It's on Game Boy Advance and PS2 and probably a PS3 collection. I liked it because I liked the gameplay. I liked the card. I thought, I thought it did that well. Kind of like action-y with cards thrown in. And then it was more about like these human characters. And the Disney characters were like your summons. Mm -hmm. They were, you know, they were in the game. But I thought it was more focused on the people and not the Disney aspect. I did like okay. that better. But yeah, that first one, I I don't know. I just It wasn't for me, I guess. I, I did enjoy the combat. I loved doing that Sephiroth fight. Stuff like that in the arena. I liked beating bosses. I liked the upgrade system. But just that Disney theme kind of, you know, put it a little down for me. Mm -hmm. Hey, what else? What else is another overrated game? Oh, um... Oh man, we can't talk about non RPGs. I was gonna say Call of Duty. That's uh, well, super... that goes without saying. Wait, Destiny. That's kind of an RPG. <laughs> it had RPG elements. I have not played that yet. Super overrated. Played it. Um, I'm kind of skeptical of that kind of online console deal as a whole. You know, like mm -hmm. the RPG on the console. I'd rather play on PC. You know, but really? Yeah. I feel like RPGs were made for consoles. Yeah, but Destiny was kind of like that hybrid. Oh, yeah, that would definitely be more of a PC and it had game. A, lot of a shooter. Elements. Yeah. Yep. Which is why I never even considered it, but. Um, I just. I didn't care for it. I thought it was a lot of the same with. I don't know, the battle. It didn't even have a battle system, it was just shooting. Yeah. That's not a good one. Ah. I mean, it uh -huh. did get decent range. It does get a lot of hate, though, too. Oh, I think there yeah. are. I don't think you're the only one thinking that. You know, it's not it's as good of all as that, people say. It's because of all that DLC. I don't think you should be charged that much for DLC. <laughs> it's in the game. Just, just release it or something. Don't charge like forty dollars for an hour or two of gameplay. That's rude. I mean, I, I definitely agree as well. I'm, I'm not into that. <sighs> hold on, right. hold on. Um, anything else? Anything come to mind? Overrated games. I really can't think of anything because, like, I just play what I like, and. Yeah. I know what you mean. I'm looking at my collection now, and I didn't buy a lot of those. So, <laughs> All the you know, things. I kind of yeah. bought the ones that I wanted, so... Um, I mean, I think that I like a lot of them, but I think the Tail series gets a lot of hype that's maybe not warranted. It's gotten, like, it has, what, like, ten games in the series. Uh-huh. I say, like, three are really good, or, you know, like, above average. I say three are above average. Everything else, I think, is below average. So as a series as a whole, I do think it's overrated. That being said, I love Symphonia. I love Fantasia. I like Eternia, stuff like that. But, again, as a whole, I think you kind of expect those games to be good and you kind of force yourself to think that they're good, but yeah. maybe not really. Yeah, I all think right. I think that's all I can think of. Okay. <clears throat> all right, why don't we move on to the next one, then? Sure.